what's up? Thank you so much for watching. Mostly saying I am Prajita. Welcome back to another Thursday. Now, a lot of you guys were requesting me to do a video which is called Types of People You Meet in Movie Theater. A lot of other amazing creators have made those videos. Go ahead and check them out. So I thought, hmm, how do I listen to them? But not quite. So I thought I'll give it my own middle class twist. So today you and me are going to be discussing about types of people that you will definitely meet if and when you ever happen to go to a single screen theater. Remember those? Do ya? Do ya? Let me help you. For those of you all who have been to single screen theaters before, hi to the five. But if you haven't been, here's new knowledge. Educate yourself. Rich spoiled brats. Expressors. Now, when I first said single screen theaters, what was the one thing that came to your mind? You went like, oh my god, single screen theaters are like so cheap. You have people that are whistling, they like shout, they like dance, I mean they're so loud. Let me tell you, okay, all of that is true. Why do we judge these people? These people just say out loud what all of us are thinking. So during a movie, they're going to be the ones who are whistling really loud, who are dancing when the song comes on, who are like passing amazingly flattering comments on the heroine. <laughs> Yeah, that. Number two are the fighters. Now, isn't this kind of just expected? I mean, hang now a little bit in a cinema hall where people are overly expressive of everything that they're feeling, thinking, sensing during the movie. They tend to get into little like tiny tiny arguments not much they'll stab you like once no more than that i mean it's tiny it's not that big just one stab's good enough that's 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 what yeah oh sorry sorry huh eight minute huh sorry oh sorry sorry washroom sorry 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 i'm so sorry Are phone ban karna uncle ke garden mein kya what film is that number three are the lovebirds out of all the people that you will meet in the cinema hall, these are the only kind of people who do not care who's dying, an earthquake's there, the film stop playing. Who cares? They, they, they're not there for the film. This is like the most economical makeout place on the surface of this art. <laughs> I need friends. Also, the amazing thing about lovebirds is somehow fate is never in their favor. So they're always going to be seated in front of like a whole family where small kids just lean over their chairs like the the. <laughs> Number four are the torch bearers. Now these are the kind of people who will walk around cinema halls all throughout the movie in pitch darkness and every 20 minutes stumble on every toe that they see and then hurt the person brutally and then come over to your seat, flash their flashlight in your face which is so strong that if you flash it towards the sky you can probably see Jadu waving at you. Hello. Ah! Okay. Madam, take it. Oh. And number five are... The people who went to the single screen cinemas and then regretted going to the single screen cinemas. I couldn't think of a title, okay? Now, I don't know how much you guys are going to be relating to this because this is very, very personal. This is something that didn't mean... This is something that used to happen with my family all the time. So back when multiplexes were not really a rage, all we went to watch cinemas at were the single screens. And also after the multiplexes came in, they were very expensive at the beginning. Like we could not afford that. So we used to go to single screen cinemas, right? And then every time I remember we went for a movie, we would come out regretting going there, complaining about the AC not working, the seats being torn, you know, rats giving us company during the movie. But then again, we always went there back because... So I... So yeah. These are the people who go and then regret and then go again. I guess we never learn from our mistakes. What they have made this theater these days. First it was so nice. The AC was working good. The seats were good. Now you sit in seat. You touch your bum on ground. You go in like that. Yeah, yeah. Next time say we won't come here. We'll pay 500 rupees extra. But we'll go to that big uh, multiplex that has opened near house. Baba, let's go for a movie. Huh? Say now what show Anand Theatre has what time? Alright, so that was types of people in single screen cinemas. If you haven't been there and you want to try something that's totally obnoxious and unhealthy, go for it. But if you have been there before, now I think it's pretty shady but before they were quite good and that's when we went, you know what I'm talking about. Oh my god, I'm old. Speaking of old... <laughs> yeah. How many days to go, beta? 
Friday, Saturday, Sunday. Three days. Three days to go. Three. One, two. Three. <laughs> Just say. If you like this video, give it a big fat thumbs up. Don't forget to come up with new videos every Tuesday and every Thursday. I will see you guys on Tuesday until we meet. Love, love.